I'm now joined by Hitachi Reva KTM UK rider Sean Simpson. Sean, thanks for joining us. Is it fair to say that you're perhaps expecting big things this year after a strong 2014 season? Coming in under the radar, I think uh, this year there's been a lot of hype and a lot of expectation from uh, Antonio, from Ryan, from uh, Gautier, a lot of the, the top names this year in, in the championship. But I don't mind being a sort of uh, outsider or a, a, you know a, a name that not many people are thrown onto the table because you know that's kind of you know what I sort of thrive from, and you know I'm looking forward to it. Um, another year on the KTM uh, 450, and you know we rode well last year. Haven't had to change too many things for this year, so just really looking to you know build on on what I had last year. This is perhaps the first year in a long time that you've stuck with the same setup. Uh, is it a case of if it ain't broke, don't fix it? Yeah, definitely. The Hitachi Revo team's done a great job for me. Um, KTM 450, you know, I haven't had to change, uh, you know, change machinery. A lot of people's actually changed back down to the 350. I did test it towards the end of last year and I just preferred the torque and the overall setup that we had on the 450. So, you know, the suspension's been working great, the power delivery, you know, just had to work a little bit on my starts, but, um, you know, looks like we've got them more or less on point. You know, last week in Qatar, we had a couple of, uh, a couple of top five starts and I think that's just going to make things a lot easier especially with the, the field being so stacked as it is. You know with 20 guys or 18 to 20 guys who've been on the podium in MXGP um, you know you could be battling for fifth or 15th you know in the same sort of you know tough battle so you know just hoping that we can you know and you know improve that week on week out and hopefully have a few hole shots this year. And now that racing has got underway is it good to get into the swing of things again? Yeah, definitely. I think, you know, everyone's in the same boat, really. We've had, uh, you know, X amount of months off and not too much racing or too much excitement. And a lot of laps and, you know, on the tracks and in the gym. But uh, now that the racing started going again, I think it's just, you know, everyone gets the, the pre-race nerves and everything out of the way. And then, uh, you know, coming in with a bang at Qatar, it was nice to get back on the start line, back with, you know, 30 other guys on the line that's, you know, top quality racing. And now we've got Ryan on the, the grid as well. It's you know so much you know anticipation, and everyone's ready to get going and, and really show what they can do. So just looking forward to it. It's going to be 18 rounds this year. It's going to be a long season, and uh, you know it's just going to be uh, everyone fighting as hard as they can till that last race. Sean, best of luck for this weekend. I hope this track roughs up nicely for you. Thanks for chatting to us.